Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to find the cutest and cheapest clothes on AliExpress. Usually you can find these clothes on Pretty Little Thing or Boohoo, but because those sites are so popular and well known, the clothes are just going to be sold out. So this is another resource that you can use to find clothes, probably for cheaper than you're seeing on other websites and it can be a little hard to navigate so i'm just going to show you the ins and outs to aliexpress for clothes shopping how you can find exactly what you're looking for so that's it we're going to jump into the video i'm going to be looking on this ipod here and i'm just going to put up the screen recording so that you guys can see so let's get started Okay guys, so I moved over to the side as you can see and I'm going to put the screen recording from the iPod right here. Um, okay, so getting started, I'm going to start the screen recording now. So obviously you want to open up AliExpress. Looks exactly the same on the app on the iPhone as it does on the iPod. We're gonna start with the camera roll. So you can hit the camera in the top right. So that's what I'm gonna do. Then you can search by code. If you wanna just creep and take a picture of the person's outfit, you can do that. Or in the bottom left, you can click on the camera roll. This is not my iPod, so I took a bunch of selfies just to hide the camera roll a little bit. But here's a picture I already had saved that I found. So as you can see, it searches the item and pulls up similar, if not exact results. So there's a bunch of stores that sell the same thing and you can look through here. Or you can check, as you can see, by order. And that's just how many people bought this item and you can go from there and it makes it a lot safer and guarantees that you're going to be getting exactly what's pictured. So this one has a lot of orders, the, the first one, and it has a good rating. It has a 4.7. I would say anything over a 4.5. has a video of someone trying it on pictures. There's the exact picture that I searched. So another thing you want to do is read the reviews. So go through and you can see there's a bar here. So I'm going to click on reviews. Read through these customer reviews. Read through them. Make sure that they are saying good things. A lot of people have something good to say about the item, but take your time going through. You can also search one star five stars so clicking on five star you can see the good things people have said and you can kind of compare that to the one stars nothing is ever perfect there's things that happen so some people are going to let you know that they might have had a, a problem with their order um so it's just up to you to see is this worth it do i want to purchase this item also look at american comments so i hit the american flag just to see is shipping going to be the same for you you can see uh, comments in your language so those are important to look through as well okay so i'm satisfied with the item i want to add it to my cart so you can pick out your color the size and how many and then you can click on shipping as well this store offers free shipping. Not all stores do. This store does. They have different options as well. Some cost more, um, but it depends on maybe who you prefer to ship your item. If you like DHL or someone else, then you can go with that. It doesn't make much sense to me when there's free shipping. The one downfall is that it takes a month. So as you can see, the delivery date suggested is 531. And for reference, today's April 30th. So it takes a while to ship. Um, but I'm going to click on apply and add that to my cart. And I just think it's worth it because I've seen this set. It's been really popular since last fall. Um, and I'm finding it on AliExpress for $14. So I'm adding that to my cart. Another thing you can do is that top bar again slide it over to recommended items and then you can find similar items that are also really cute and you can just scroll through and look and that's how you really find 
the current popular clothes on AliExpress. Just looking through the recommended items, at least for me, it really works. So I actually really like this dress and I might actually get it. So um, this is probably a video and it just takes a second to load, but there's pictures here. Yeah, so I'll probably look through this later. So another thing you can do is add this to your wish list. So I'm gonna click on the heart turns red, adds to my wish list, and that's why, if you didn't already, make an account with AliExpress, because I don't think it can save without you making an account, so you have it to go back to. So yeah, that's saved under my wish list. Going back to the camera, let's say you don't have something saved in your camera roll already, you can take pictures from anywhere and save them to your camera roll. You can go on Instagram. We're gonna go on the internet, and I know corset tops are also really popular. So if you have like an idea in your head already for what you are looking for, maybe you've seen it somewhere but you couldn't take a picture, I would try and find the image, type it in on Google. So this top is really cute. So I'm going to click on that. It takes me to some website. I've never shopped here. I don't know what website this is but I'm gonna save this image to my camera roll. I see the item is almost $30 on their website, $29.69. So I'm gonna leave and go back to AliExpress and I'm going to pull up this corset top. It's searched through jeans, so please note that you can move this around because I'm not interested in the jeans, I'm interested in the top. And you can see it's pulled up the item. Um, you can search by orders as well for this item and you're seeing it come up and it's really popular. So, and you can see it's also cheaper than the previous website that we got the image from. So a lot of people really sell similar items. They probably get their clothes off from the same place. But let's say you can't find a seller that's really popular. So another thing you can do is click on the item. So this has zero, if I go back, zero sold, but uh, 12 saves. And you know, you really like the top, but you can't find something that has a large amount of orders or any large amount of reviews. Another thing you can do in the bottom left corner again is click on the store. That's what that icon is. Go to the store. They have 300 followers on the store. They have a lot more clothes for sale. Some of their clothes have more um, orders. So you can play around like that and decide is this something that I wanna buy based on the store seller. Based on the seller, do I think this is a good quality item? Maybe you can look through other items they've sold at their reviews and see if that's something you'd like. Okay. And that's it for the camera. Of course, you can always just search by the bar. If you wanna just type in maybe like bikinis. And of course, AliExpress has a bunch of stuff, not just clothes, but maybe um, this is a good way to just search what you're looking for. And this bikini's cute right here. There's a swimsuit here that I had saved already and it kind of, helps to just kind of make the timeline your own thing here. So that's another great thing as it kind of figures out your style and what you like. Like I searched for this item earlier and it's pulled it up on my general homepage. And as you can see, it's saved to my wish list because I'm considering buying it. So now I'm just going to show you my cart. So first I'm gonna just show you my wish list just because. So there's a whole bunch of stuff on here because uh, I don't know, I think I have money, I guess. Um, and, you know, so I'm interested in buying those things and I just have them saved right now. And then there's my cart, which has 22 items in it because I don't know, like I didn't even get a stimulus check. Like, I don't know why I think I can spend this money, but you know, here's just some things I have in my cart right now. So the cool thing is there's 22 items here, um, but it doesn't mean I have to buy all 22 items. Um, really quickly, this dress was literally on Pretty Little Things website and it was super popular. So 
and it's 10.49 here. I don't know how much it is on Pretty Little Thing, if they still have it, um, but just showing you that, you know, you can really go other places to get these clothes. So let's say I'm interested in this corset top, this bodysuit, this dress here. I can just check out those three items or I can hit on check out all if I want to. And the last thing I'm gonna mention is that there are coupons, as you can see, for each individual store. So you can just click on get coupons and click on get, it'll say it's been added to your account. And you can do that with each store and you'll end up saving even more money. Some of them I've already clicked on because um, I really am interested in buying these items. So yeah, I will actually be buying a lot of these items within the next couple days. So stay tuned if you wanna see a haul on the clothes that I got, kind of like a part two to my shopping experience with AliExpress. I'm really excited to get these clothes and to try them on. So hopefully you'll be excited to watch the video. Also, I do buy hair from AliExpress as well. I've bought bundles, I've bought wigs from AliExpress from multiple vendors. So if you're interested in seeing a hair kind of review for best vendors to purchase from for AliExpress, let me know. I do plan on making a video and uploading that very soon as well. That is all for this video. I hope this was helpful to you guys. I hope you learned some things. I hope you try out AliExpress for yourselves and let me know what you think and how it worked out for you. As always, I post videos throughout the week, so I will have some other videos coming up. Come back to my channel and check out for more. I hope you enjoyed this video and you guys are taking care of yourselves. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video.